To, to coach Morse and, and his team they, I think they deserve they deserve the win because they they are more consistent than, than us during all the game I think the first half was was okay we execute in offense what we want to execute uh, we were we limit the the mistakes in defense and and of course we were dominate inside but but we we know that was with their three and therefore they are more physical than, than us. But I think we did uh, a good job. And then after that, I really think we have two crucial moments, the start of the, of the second half, uh, where we, we miss, we miss open, open, open shots and, and the, they can run, the, they go on transition, they, they score 8-0 on, on two, one minute 30. Uh, so, we have not a great shooting night, but at that moment it was expensive. Um, and then later, I don't know why, uh, we, we were frustrated during some minutes against the refs. And I don't say the, the refs don't call the right thing. I said my players were, were frustrated, I don't know why. And we really lose the, the focus in offense. And once again, it was expensive because they, they score in transition. Uh, I think on an half court game, we, we were really okay. But when you give when you give 20 on fast break and, and 12 on second chance, it's difficult to win here in Antwerp against a team like that. So, well, it's okay for me. I think I saw 40 minutes uh, decent offense. If you look, uh, 25 assists and only six turnovers. I think that uh, that shows that you play pretty much the right way with good ball movement. Defensively, uh, I saw 20 good minutes. First half, we were not really aggressive, I think. Uh, not good enough in the ball screens, opening up the paint completely, uh, backdoor cuts, just a lack of aggressi aggressiveness. We stay in the game in first half because we have enough talent offensively and we move the ball well offensively. We have 16 assists at the half. I'm happy with the way uh, they stepped up second half, uh, defensively for sure, putting pressure because you know we have a lot of players to go to go to work. So if you put that pressure at one point, uh, the, uh, an opponent is going to have a tough, a tough period, and we took advantage of that. Basically, for me, that's the most important thing. Yeah, like I said, uh, it was in the post, but for sure also uh, in the ball screens where we were uh, not aggressive enough on the ball, so they could find easy passes, and and there was nobody. Help side position was was terrible. I think we were a little bit afraid, and that our man would score, and that's always something destructive for uh, for a defense. But it's it's it starts with aggressiveness. If you're not aggressive on the ball. Good teams with good point guards, they will find solutions and, and they hurt us really bad inside first half, especially. And the second half, uh, yeah, you made uh, the first half uh, the difference I think so, and then you see that we have a uh, serious rim protection with, with, with Kingsley, who 
who blocks a lot of shots, but also changes a lot of shots. That's, that's really a plus for our defense, the way he's playing last uh, last couple of weeks. But it starts with, with, everything starts with the pressure on the ball. If you don't let teams create what they want to create, get them out of their place, then we have the tools to, uh, to play good defense. I just want to. I just want to add uh, about uh, Jason because I know there's a lot of questions, and I think it's my job uh, to protect him. Also, he uh, he has a problem on his foot, lower leg, let's say, nothing too serious, but he has. It's been, it's been bothering him already for weeks. Uh, he's been playing with it. I think I have to thank him for that. That he's playing with that with that uh, pain. But at one point, I think we have to listen to uh, to the injury, and uh, and give him some some. Maybe two weeks can be enough. We we went to see a specialist. Two two weeks can be enough. But I think I have to give him that, and I think he needed me to let everybody know also that okay, he's playing. He's not playing to his full potential. We all know that. He's a little bit frustrated, but there's really uh, there's there's an actual problem with that foot, with that leg. So he's probably not going to play the next uh, two weeks. Okay, thank you, Coach. Can I just have your top three then, please? To me, uh, Kingsley, Kalinowski, uh, Van Damme. Uh, Kingsley, Van Wayne, and uh, Simons. Simons. Thank you, Jeff. Thank you. We got another one! We got another one!